fertilized yellow. Earth. Noah is my little sister. She is one of the smartest kids I know. She's beautiful. Me and my dad are professional shooters, and my sister, and I do have a brother. He's not quite there yet, but. <laughs> Getting my kids involved is a natural progression of doing what I love and passion on my passion for gun building, shooting, being outdoors. Let's go girls. My favorite thing to do is shoot guns. Most of the time I'm just a normal girl who goes to school. Um, unless I'm with my dad and it's a weekend, the most likely thing we're going to do is go hunt or shoot. 187 yards. Make a nice, easy trigger pull. 520 yards. The farthest shot I've ever shot a deer was at 520 yards. My longest shot would be 1,196 yards. It's always been a part of our lives, as long as I can remember. Hold right of center. Long distance shooting is, is different than any other discipline of shooting. Math, ballistics, wind. You really have to be a student of the game to be able to do it. When you're a precision rifle builder, you have to pick the right industry partners, barrel, stock, trigger, scope, rings. Each of those components is a piece of the puzzle. I've shot Timony for now for probably 20 years. It's, it's really the only trigger that I've ever really known. I know for a fact I can experience a hot load, I can eject that round, clear it out, and I know that my trigger will continue to run. Recently, about two weeks ago, maybe three, we built a shed. If you can see, we have a peanut wagon below us, and then we have what we call our Taj Mahal. The Taj Mahal is obviously the nicest deer stand around. It's easy to track game from long distances. Here's a pair of binos. You will basically look down there with the binos, see if you see a deer. We hunt a little bit different than most people in Georgia. The shortest shot to any wood line is 400 yards. The longest is in excess of 900 yards. The most probable spot that we're gonna see them is right down where they are. All my kids have grown up competitive shooting. A three or four or 500 yard shot to my seven year old up to my 22 year old is, you know, it's, it's just an everyday shot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh! Just use a First deer, first deer. They've all hunted with me since they could, you know, ethically and, and skillfully shoot a rifle. And it's built many of the memories that our family is founded on. You can watch out for deer bucks. Mostly it's just that you get to be concentrated on loving your family and shooting.
watching any child harvest animals, watching them squeeze the trigger, and then the excitement when they walk up upon it, those are probably some of the best memories in the world. The family time that we get, I don't think that a lot of other families get to bond like we do over hobbies. We love shooting, but we love family and cooking and hanging out together. That's way more important than any shooting or hunting. Family is a very big part of my life. At the end of the day, they're the people that have your back no matter what. A lot of people don't get to have that. Anytime you can have all three kids in the same location at the same time is probably my favorite time of the year. We will leave here with memories created that you'll look back upon as they get older and they'll remember those times. Being around the people that I love and getting to do fun stuff with them, like shooting or hunting and riding four-wheelers around, spending time with them, the time that I have with them right now is very valuable.